Remove the screws holding the top cover. Tilt the top cover forward and be careful not to stretch parts or use intensive force. Release the adapter from the connection block, first with tongue pliers and then by hand. Make sure to have something to drain the oil into. Note how the tube is routed from the connection block to the controller. Carefully release the adapter from the controller with wrench number 12 and remove the tube. Route the new tube and reverse the process. Connect the tube to the controller first and then to the connection block. Before attaching the new tube, make sure to make a sharp vertical cut. Place the adapter nut on the tube first. Then connect as shown on the video. Tighten until it stops, but don't exaggerate the force. Remove the measuring point cap and attach the pressure gauge. Loosen the outer nut on the pressure controller, number 18. Then, with an Allen key, uh, turn the pressure controller counterclockwise to lower the pressure. Start the machine. To set the pressure, Pull the actuating lever towards the seat while carefully adjusting the pressure controller with an Allen key. To increase the pressure, turn the bolt clockwise very slowly. To decrease the pressure, turn the bolt counterclockwise very slowly. Set the pressure to about 20 bars. It should not exceed 22 bars. When pressure is at desired level, tighten the bolt on the pressure controller. This is very important.